My boo birthday coming up. Hey y'all, pretty. Juju girl. Let me tell y'all about this nasty sicko. Don't to be showing like half of your body. Just stuff where me and her can interact with each other and try to make, you know, little stuff fun. Make sure y'all watch over y'all kids. I can't say it enough. Where the sun shines all the time, good love and my soul's what I crave. Hey. Oh jeez! Welcome to another vlog. If you're new here, it's your girl Chocolate Emoji. Make sure you subscribe, like, and turn on your post notifications. Okay, girl. Girls, guys, all the people. Okay. I be trying to be all inclusive, but it is July 1st. Yay! They finna start construction. I'm so sick. Of goddamn, looking at construction. Um. However, I'm on my way. To do a little shopping, little shopping. Um, my boo birthday coming up, and I'm just getting like little stuff because he he just I don't know. Uh, like I always say, men don't like go all out for their birthdays. They don't do like the most. And, like you know how the girls like to dress up, do stuff, even if it's not like going on a trip, but like you know go have dinner, you know go. Go do a little excursion, you know. Let's go wine tasting. Let's like go go to go see a show or something. Like you know, men don't really. That's not they stilo. That's not they. That's not they thing. So at least the men in my life. So I figure I'm just gonna go and get the things that he likes, that I know he likes, and that he appreciates. So that's what I'm about to go do. I was gonna make like a whole little care package. Like not like a care package, but like how can I describe it? I was gonna do like the um the senses, like how you got touch, smell, um, taste, you know, stuff like that. But I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna do it, I don't know if I'm in a goddamn mood. I'm not even finna hold you. I'm not even finna hold you. I don't feel like it because I was supposed to go to I still probably can. It's really finna depend on how I'm feeling because as long as I get the two major things that I feel like he appreciate, my job is done. That's just how I feel. Not like, you know, I don't care. I do. I just, I know he's not gonna give a fuck about the other stuff. I want the other stuff is really for me because <laughs> that's how I am. <laughs> but I'm really trying not to be me and put me in the equation because it's not my birthday. <laughs> But nevertheless, we're going shopping, child. Um, after this, I just gotta go. I just got done editing. It is exporting right now, all that good stuff. So by the time I get home, hopefully it's already exported and I can upload it to YouTube and have it ready for tonight. But that's mostly the vibes. I just been up, um, started laundry. Started laundry. And are we going or are we not? Yeah, I started laundry. Uh, went outside, like cleaned off the windows because there's like a lot of spider webs out there. And the girls be scared to open a window and they terrified of all animals. So I did that. And um, yeah, just been in a little productive mode, nothing crazy. When I get home, I'm gonna take a shower because I need one. And I just ruined my goddamn Savage X Fenty pants because I put like vinegar and um, bleach and water, and I was like spraying the outside trying to wash off the spider webs with the uh, brush. But the water kept kicking back. You know, bleach and anything once it gets on your clothes, baby, it's over. So I just messed up my um, like I don't know if y'all can tell, like right, y'all can't see. I just messed up my goddamn pants. Which I'm highly upset about. Because I kept saying, I said, be careful when you spray this shit. And then when I went in the house, after like 10 minutes of moving around, I sat down and I looked down. I said, mother. But, alright, I'm about to pull up to the first location. And then, we can head to, um, I don't know where the hell I'm going after this part this week.
but BRB babes. BR F and B. Alright. First location out of the way. Let's go to the second. Um I should really be on my Zoom and going to a lot of stores because Wednesday is mommy and me date day for me and Zuri. And I'm trying to, I need to sit down and finalize like what we gonna do. Because I need to go to the store. She wants to make pizzas from scratch because y'all know my baby like to cook. She be into cooking. And it's been a minute since we've enjoyed each other and just like cook. Tania's gonna be there as well. But she's going to be with me. Well, she's she's going to be there, but she's not going to be, you know, as much of a participant, you know, as me and Zuri. Because it's really for me and Zuri. But whatever she wants to be in, you know, that teenager phase. She don't give a damn. She want to do the pizzas, but I don't know if she's going to want to do everything. I want to um, get some arts. I'll probably save that for another day. Because I want to do a picnic with Zuri. We used to do picnics when we lived in Round Lake and we were um, out there with my Nana. But, um we stop because yeah i don't know why but i do want to do a picnic and go like to the dollar tree and get like some canvases and like some paint and we already got like a lot of paint brushes and just me and her paint and like sit outside i don't know if i'm gonna get like a little fruit or and, and stuff because zuri like i told y'all she's scared of bugs so like anything that's gonna attract bugs i kind of don't want to bring it because i want to be out there as long as we can just sitting out there vibing me and her so i think this Wednesday I'm just gonna get the pizza stuff I got a puzzle for us to do too where we can just sit at the table in the kitchen and just like sit or sit with each other just talk listen to music and just stuff where me and her can interact with each other and try to make you know little stuff fun especially since we didn't go on a um vacation because I really did want to go to Texas in June so she can go down there and see her best friend and I want to go see my TT again but laugh and we just everything was up in the air we didn't know if we was moving, you know, had to save money for that and all that stuff. But now I'm just trying to make the most of summer. I also want to take her to go do paddle boating because we did that when she was like, I want to sell like three, four. And her and Tania been like asking about it every now and then here and there. So I do want to do that, make that, make that a thing. That probably can be like the same day I do the picnic, like go paddle boating and then come home and it's like this little area by our house where you can go and sit like by the trees like get a little blanket go over there get some canvases go sit down paint a little i don't know we're gonna figure it out though um i want to attempt to have another movie night but i want to see inside out too i don't think it came out on the, of course it didn't come out because it literally just came out in the movies probably like a week or so ago but when it does come out on the um Disney Disney Plus thing. I'm okay with watching it on there because that's gonna be a vibe. We trying to we trying to utilize every little bit and ounce of what we can do for mommy and me days and just stuff to make it fun for Zuri. Um, she's not. She's been to Santa's Village and stuff. She's been enjoying her break and going outside. She got a bike now. She been yesterday. She went outside and rode her bike with her friends. I be letting her go outside. Y'all know I'm a hovering parent. I've been I've been trying to let her have a little more freedom than like, yo, stay right here where I can see you. Because yeah. But as far as me and um, me and her summer going and doing little fun stuff, I'm trying to keep it fun and cute. I do want to take her to the beach this summer. I just want to take her to the beach, like, you know, build sandcastle, let her enjoy. And then it just be packed. I be thinking as a parent, and I be trying to remember to think as a kid, like, she actively living in her childhood. So the things that I do, she's going to remember. But, I I just be thinking as a mama, like, girl, when we get there, it's going to be a lot of uh, traffic. Like, we're going to have to try to leave soon. Like, I don't want to stay the whole time because I be trying to leave to get beat traffic and trying to get out the parking lot and stuff like that so I, I need to get out of that mindset and really think like uh, like I'm doing this for my baby like be in mommy mode not introvert I don't got time for this shit mode <laughs> so yeah but y'all drop down below what are some things I'll be doing with y'all kids because life is expensive 
and although I, I be budgeting and doing stuff with Zuri and like trying to take her out and try to do stuff with her and make sure I got the funds to do stuff with her as much as I got the funds to go out and do stuff with my friends it's just like also what can we do at home to make it fun and to get her to be creative because Zuri really like I literally woke up at 2 o'clock to go pee and I went in the room and she was in the bed fully she had a binder some paper scissors and glue in the bed at 2 o'clock in the morning just cutting and making shit like girl go to sleep my sister over there on the phone watching love island love is blind love circle whatever girl if y'all don't take y'all ass to sleep so that be that be that that be them but my baby does like building and arts and crafts and stuff eventually i do want to get her like a um lego set type thing um enchantra and alanis which is zuri's classmate friend whatever who uh we be going on the play dates with she is a uh, they they are arts and craftsy as well and they be getting the legos and like making like you know little things to put around the house like a they did the flower one the canvas one like a flower canvas like come in a vase and like you could just put up you know somewhere and have it and it's cute and obviously fly, they don't die so i like that i like that it's and then it's trending too not because it's trending but it is trending i be seeing the girls be making the like you know all the little cute home decorative stuff where they got the little action figures that they just got a whole little wall dedicated to all the goddamn figures that they done built i'm like oh that's cute look at them i love that for the girls but my baby just is naturally into building she likes building she likes like i told y'all before when we, when we went downtown to get to the less fortunate like her phone she just kept taking pictures of um Chicago's buildings and skyline like architect like stuff like that is her vibe and I love that for her because express yourself girl be creative whatever you see whatever you want to build make it if you can imagine it girl you can do it so I want to pour into that side of her and you know do stuff with my baby but enough about me <laughs> enough about me and ranting because I be feeling I've been feeling pretty fucking repetitive saying the same stuff, but that's how my brain be. Until I get it accomplished, like, until I do it, it's on loop. That's all I'm thinking about is this week. What the fuck I gotta do for this week? How can I, what I need to accomplish what's on this week's to-do list. I can't go no further. I can't think about next goddamn week. My head, I start double booking. I can't remember what day it is. It's overwhelming. I'm, I'm, I'm getting anxiety. That's dead ass how I be feeling. I was gonna go to the Dollar Tree to get canvases. I could really get that stuff, but I don't. I don't feel like it. I don't feel like it. And this. Uh, this is me giving the most, <laughs> and all I got is like sixty percent on me, and that's still me giving a hundred percent. I'm still giving all sixty percent of me. Okay. I hope my friend here. The people at the liquor store shouldn't be your friend, but they my friend. Ooh, good morning emojis. It's the next day. And your girl just finished making a TikTok, TikTok seller account. Because y'all know these clothes. I gotta get rid of some of this shit. So I'm just gonna sell it on TikTok. And now we're about to go through it and sort it and see what we're gonna keep and what we're gonna give away. And go from there, honey. So let's get to it.
Come back. Mommy duties. It don't matter what I'm doing, where I'm at. Mommy duties comes. You gotta do what you gotta do. Or well, they gonna keep coming back and ask you. So never mind that I look like a hoochie mama. My daughter home. And she wants some hash browns, some scratch, some grits and eggs. You like this dress? Mm -hmm. Or no? I'm selling no. it. No. I'm selling it. You don't like it? No. You do not need to be covered up. No. I don't need to be covered up? No, you don't need to be showing like half of your body. You're right, that's why I'm selling it. Cause I don't wear it, I never wear it. So I'm selling it on TikTok. <laughs> Girl. You know what you can sell? What? Your head, your neck, your arms, your legs. That's it. I feel you. That's why I'm selling my clothes. Because I don't wear the stuff that shows my body. I wear like crop tops, but I don't wear like booty shorts that be in my booty and showing my booty. Dresses like this. Yeah. I don't wear it. I mean, I bought them because I thought I was going to wear them. You oh, thought. okay. When I was, she said, you thought. Girl. But when I go out with friends, yeah, you be saying what I wear. I, don't, I just don't be wearing these. Because I be like, ooh. I'm gonna go outside and somebody's gonna try to creep on me and talk to me and yeah. get at me. And Change your danger. Yeah. Make sure you have a pocket knife. Girl, you already know I keep that thing on me. But, yeah. I thought I was gonna be a hot girl. Hot girl summer? Yeah. I thought I was gonna wear stuff like this, but then I got scared. <laughs> I got scared when it got here. And I was like, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna really do that. Breakfast is done. I cook. She really did. She did the eggs. She did the eggs and uh, where y'all died? I was saying, Zuri helped cook. But now back to business. Back to life. Back to reality. Good morning, babes. I am about to open this package. Um, honestly. I don't know what's in it, but I'm thinking it's the scale that I bought. I hope it is. Lord. Oh. It's not a scale, but it is a label printer. <laughs> the pictures but I have to edit some of the pictures because they just look like they need to be edited to me and then I need to upload and like put the description and the size and all that into the um into this app but my hiccup right now is I need to wait like it won't let me proceed like it is required that you put in the weight of the package and the height and the width and the length and it's like god damn boy I don't even got packages yet. I got the damn labeler, but I don't have, like, I think I'm gonna go on. But it's like, I don't wanna buy this shit yet. I wanna see how it goes first. If people are gonna be trying to buy stuff before I start investing in more stuff than I need. You feel me? Or should I just buy, buy the damn packages and, and shut up? I'm finna look up a scale. I need a scale from Amazon. I'd rather get the scale than the little um than to order packages. Use kitchen scale or postal scale, not a bathroom scale. Or have a package weighed at the post office. See, yeah, I got I just I was just using the damn bathroom scale and I know that shit right. Okay, so 
let me do this it's also the mommy and me date me and Zuri are gonna be having my sister and my mom are gonna join in um my mom's at work so by the time we do the pizza my mom will be off and she'll be home so she's gonna join in right there but gonna do the puzzle for sure that i got over here and just chill and chit chat and talk and listen to music and just have fun but both of them are still asleep it's 12 o'clock so around like this time to one o'clock they'll be waking up and eating so that's what's on the agenda today and i really don't want to make like drag this out longer than it has to be be present and have fun with zori and just talk to her you know get on each other's nerve because that's all we do really get on each other's goddamn nerve but that's on the agenda today let me figure this out I'm gonna pick you guys up probably tomorrow, honestly. Cause like I said, today is a is a is a chill day. Say hi to the girls. Uh, oh. Oh, I'm gonna say y'all. Hold on. Tania is kind of naked. Oh, uh, hey y'all. Pretty. Juju girl. Give yeah. a shout out. Uh, I know. Shout out to you. Know. We're about to run to storage because my sister, last night her best friend Juju spent the night. And then now tonight Cassie and Juju are spending the night. So we got to run to storage to get the, uh, what's the air mattress so the baby can sleep comfortably. But um, let me tell y'all about this nasty sicko. So today, obviously, it was nice out. Y'all know the girls be living in the pool. So they went to the um to the pool. Zuri went with Tania and her best friend. And when they got over there, it was this forty-year-old man trying to talk to them and be a pervert and a creep. A fucking. Creep. And he was he was like, they were like, we don't know you. He's like, my name's Emmett. I'm um forty. If you want to get to know me. And he was being weird. I'm going to the office. I'm My baby started out. crying. Yeah. Motherfucker. I didn't know he gave name, honey. Mm. Oh, no. <laughs> I said, y'all should have called me. Well, but they called my stepdad. He went over there. But uh, next time, um, one of y'all need to record and somebody need to call an adult. Because I'm sure get a picture of himself or his nasty ass. But, yeah, we're going to run to the store. Y'all can't see me no more. So bad. I decided up them kids. I'm making these damn cookies. I'm gonna make half tonight. They're gonna make the rest for their little challenge or whatever. But back to my story, y'all. Y'all be safe and make sure y'all watch y'all kids. This is why I be not wanting Zori to go and play outside of my sight. Just cause we live in a community, like it's still not safe. Cause he literally was over there just being a creep. And then when my stepdad went over there, the girls was telling him what happened, and the guy had already like left. Like, as soon as my stepdad pulled up, he seen him get out. So, you have to, like, go. The way you got to leave out, out of our pool house, whatever. He just left and disappeared. But it was a lady over there. She didn't speak English. I think she was Polish. We not, I'm not sure. But she didn't speak English. But my stepdad said she, like, gave me her phone and gave me the dude's number. So, the girls was like, yeah, he was trying to talk to her. And then he came from over that side. And then he came and sat next to us. And then he's like, what type of music y'all like? Y'all like this music? And, like, asking them, um... They said a bunch. I can't remember off the dome, but he was just trying to engage with them. And then my sister's best friend, Juju, she was like, why are you talking to teenagers? Like, she called it out. She, it's, This is weird. And you're, like, trying to talk to us. Like, you're not just engaging in the conversation. You're being weird. Why are you over here talking to teenagers? And she was like, we don't know you. He was like, um, my name is something with an A, and I'm 40 if you want to get to know me. Sick-ass people. So I'm making half of my cookies, and then y'all can make y'all half. Did I have it better? No. They did it. They did it. Okay. So yeah, y'all be safe and watch all damn kids because people are perverts. Oh, uh, who was that? I don't know. Ask. Ask. Who is it? Who is that their mom? Did she come and get something? No, she's up her house. Who? Angie. Angie. I'll say that. Is 
She used the doorbell. That's why we don't recognize it. Right? Hell, my TT now. We all never. Because you don't. We don't know. I said she used the doorbell. We don't ever know that. <laughs> But anyways, y'all watch y'all kids. Y'all be safe. Make sure y'all watch over y'all kids. I can't say it enough because people are weird and creepy and they will try you next though. But I'm gonna make my cookies. So I love y'all. I'm in the vlog right here. I'm gonna see y'all next time.